Hey everyone, welcome back to Island View in Ostriv. Yeah, this is, uh, well, uh, we've got the, uh, we've got the trading post under construction. That's, uh, that's going to, uh, allow trading with other towns and that will allow getting, uh, you know, some food in to tide things over while the, uh, farming here gets online and other stuff. Uh, now something that it occurred to me I should do is add another market stall here, uh, which, um, okay. So if I put it here, right, uh, and then I go in here and only hire women, yeah, and I hire a worker, and then I put firewood on all four uh locations right okay so we'll do that right now meanwhile uh this is gonna take a while to build it's collecting resources and everything because i built everything i built the sources down here and every and i'm building stuff up here you know it's taking a little bit longer right but we're going at uh speed level two so for time passage so it's not too bad now what i'm going to do is actually expand the farm fields. Now, uh, that is... Uh, I, I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a sort of grid type thing over here with them. I, I'm going for slightly smaller fields here uh, because I want to have more of a patchwork. Right? So if we, we come out here, you know, do like this and you know down to about here right and i come over here and i rotate it so that the the gate is where i want it okay so we got a farm field right then we can add another one here where we come down like this right and like this and like this right got another field and if we grab another field we can come down, say, over here, right? And come out to, say, here. Come up to here, right? And we can do that, right? This is a pretty steep uh, bank here into the river, so probably won't be building much along there. Uh, right, okay. And I need to... I'm going to build another uh, six fields here. Uh, you know, uh, in counting the ones I've just built, right? Okay, and I'm going to put the other two over here, right? So I can do this, come out to here, up to here, and then I can rotate that because I want, yep, yeah, okay. And then the final one is going to be here. It's going to go up kind of like this to here, over to here, and then down to here. All right? Okay. So that's, uh, that's the fields. So now I'm going to set up the, uh, the crop rotations and everything, right? I'm going to use the same rotation I use on these, which is potatoes, potatoes and buckwheat, right? Uh, so, I'm going to, no. Uh, this is going to be potato, this is going to be buckwheat, and that's going to be fallow, right? And this is going to be fallow, and then potato, and then buckwheat, right? Uh, and then this is going to be buckwheat, fallow, potato, all right? Yeah, there we go. And then we'll do that again. Potato, buckwheat, fallow. Fallow, potato, buckwheat. And this is going to be buckwheat, fallow, potato. Right? Okay, now we can go in here and activate all the fields. Okay. 
There we go. So that means uh, next spring we'll have, we should have six of these going. But wait, okay, potato, oh, buckwheat, potato, fallow, buckwheat, potato, fallow, buckwheat, potato, yeah, okay, yeah. I just flipped the order of the two operational uh, fields, and that's fine. Now, this here has all the resources necessary for the building. It's, uh, it's all uh, ready to go here. Uh, so it's just waiting for the labor to finish, right? Now, that's going to take a minute, but... Uh, once this is online, I will definitely hire a uh, a uh, uh, trader, and then we'll start trading for uh, for some resources, right? Uh, yeah. Now something else uh, oh, that I want to do down here. I want to put some benches. Yeah, we'll put a couple benches down here over by the the uh, farm fields. Uh huh. Um. What is the uh, yeah? Yeah, put that there. Um, okay, and over here. Why benches? Because why not? Right? So, having a bunch of benches uh, just seems like the sort of thing we might want to do. You know, benches here, there, and everywhere, right? Uh, okay, so... Now let's uh, check in on this thing here, where we're, uh, no, yeah, where we can observe the uh, construction as they walk through the wall to do their construction work, right? Uh, so it seems terribly efficient, doesn't it? So my goal here is to get to the point where I can bring... Uh, half a dozen more families into the town, I think. Uh, I think that's what I'm going to need for the uh, for the farming. Or maybe double the number of families. So, uh, another nine houses. Probably nine houses with yards. Uh, that is probably uh, what I'll go for here. So, where would I put them? Well, I guess, that's a good question. Where would I put them? Where is the one that, oh, there's the one that's scheduled. So one here. Okay, so we'll grab one of these. No. Okay, so we'll do this. Uh, so it's that wide, huh? So we'll queue one of those there. Okay. Now, I think uh, maybe uh, putting... Putting a couple along here might not be the worst option. Yeah, I think, I think if I put this here, so that's four, five, right? And I could put a number of them here. Right. Okay. Well, that's eight scheduled. Uh, and I think that's a uh, good uh, collection of them. 
So we'll let that just uh, tick along. Now, what I'm going to do here is I am going to... Oh, we've got a cart parking over here. Uh, let's order some carts, All right? Um, and now in here, I need to hire options. Yeah. We're going to allow uh, supply by laborers. Okay. Now, what do we have for uh, workers available? Yeah. Well, we're going to have a manager here. Uh, by having a manager here, the other towns will send representatives, right? And that is the, uh, the important thing here. <clears throat> now, I think I can reasonably go in here and fire uh, all but two builders for the moment. Now, do I get a manager here? Uh, how quickly? That's a, uh, that's a good question. In case you're wondering why I lined this up this way, you got the two gates at either end of the trading post, and it just, they will go through, so it feels like a, uh, a reasonable uh, setup for... Uh, you know, it just feels like it would be lined up with the road, right? So I lined it up with the road. But we are building a town hall now, and that will allow some adjustments with the economy. And that, that will be absolutely uh, brilliant, because that will allow us to do some things that I don't understand. Yeah. Uh, I don't understand how the math connects for a number of uh, things. So... You know, there is that. Now we're into July. So we come down here. We've got two fields that are... Uh, that's buckwheat, and that's... Uh-huh. So we've got two fields that are, are growing, right? Uh, and they are ripening. Okay. Uh, right, okay. They're ripening. Good. Well, that's uh, that's much uh, much excitement. So now we just need to get to the point where there's some houses and food for sale. Uh, what are we waiting for here? Oh, lots of uh, stuff. Okay. Won't be long before we come down here and we'll see harvesting happening. Uh, harvest will start real soon now, actually. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's going to start real soon now. Okay. Uh, I'm also going to end up building several cow sheds, uh, which uh, I'm pretty sure I can support three cow sheds with the pastures. Uh, with the fallow fields serving as pastures. And that uh, that's something that I'll uh, I'll get set up as well. Uh, which will uh, uh, which will be uh, a source of meat and uh, other things, right? Yeah, see here we're harvesting. So, uh, in here, we have uh, we have potatoes. Now, I imagine there's some harvesting going on up here, too, ultimately. Um, right? So, that'll be a thing, too. Uh, something I'm going to need to uh, get set up also is a graveyard. 
And you know, I think in this area here is the perfect place for that. So if I go into here and I can go in and set up One, two, three, four, five. Ah, we've got a messenger from Marefa. And put number six of these in. Okay, so we'll put uh, some graves there. And we've got a messenger. So, what can we buy? We can buy hemp, we can buy wheat, we can buy honey. I think honey uh, might be the thing to buy, but I also think I should buy warm clothes. Yeah, probably not a bad idea. So if we buy... Yeah, we'll buy that. And we'll buy honey. Okay, now in here we need to have workers, right? Um, yeah, now in here uh, we should end up with potatoes and buckwheat uh, for sale real soon. Uh, that would be uh, really good. Now, okay, we've got a worker here. As long as we have workers in here, when the trade wagons arrive, uh, now if I, you know, if I call up the map here, uh, we've got uh, coming from here. So here's the trade wagons, right? So, yeah. Uh, where am I? Where did I end up? Okay, here here is everything. Right. Okay. So, I think... How's this doing? Yeah, we're still delivering resources. Yeah, we'll uh, fire a, a builder. Yeah. So that we get a... We should get a second guy in here. Uh, yeah, okay. Two guys in here should be enough to handle the unloading. Uh, and that should be, that should be fine. Um, the trade wagon should appear here. So, it'll take a minute to arrive. Okay. Right. So we've got that going on. And uh, what have we got here? Uh, we have buckwheat harvest, buckwheat, and potatoes. And we have here, yeah, potatoes and buckwheat. I'm going to have just double up with... Uh, uh, potatoes uh, and buckwheat here. No, I'm not. I'm going to add. Uh, I'm going to add the honey here. Uh, yeah, uh, that seems like the thing to do. Uh, is once we have the honey, we might as well be selling it, right? And here, yeah, that that's fine. Right. Now over here, right. Resource supply. Worker by cart, laborer by hands. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna make sure both of these are supplied by cart. We have two carts in here, and we're waiting for two more. Right. Um, yeah. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, there we go. There's the first uh, wagon coming in. And we will unload. Oh, I want to sell uh, warm clothes there. Yeah. And uh, here we go. We are selling some warm clothes. We got honey coming in. Yep. Okay. So we'll be selling honey. All uh, right. So let's uh, let's take a look up here. Uh, enough food for sale. So it's no housing now. Okay. So we need to get. Uh, wait. Is there more uh, wagons coming? No, I don't think there is. Okay. In that case, I can go in. No, I can go in here and hire a uh, hire another builder and fire these guys. Yeah. Okay. Right now, down here. Yep. Everything is all, all sorted out there. Good. Uh, I suppose I could have charcoal out for uh, export. Yeah, I could. Export stock, charcoal. Uh, thousand charcoal. No. Uh, we'll we'll do two thousand charcoal. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I should keep a guy on staff there. Yeah. Probably not the worst idea. Now this is just about this is just about done the uh, town hall. So that's going to. That's going to uh, pack up this tent. Okay, so we'll watch this here. Yeah, we're over here. Right. Okay. You know what we need here? A bench. Yeah, put a bench here. Yeah, put a bench there. Yeah, oh look, someone's using a bench. Nice. Okay, so how's the water doing? Fine, okay. What's this doing? Progress. Yes, it's doing progress. Well, you don't do progress, you make progress. Really? Okay, well it's making progress then. I prefer doing progress. Well, you can do things if you want. Okay, now over here, is there enough room that anyone can sneak through there? No. Good. I don't need to build a fence. Um, why am I putting graves here? Because it's useless space otherwise, right? So what what I uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a bit of uh, fencing, which is I don't know I think I want a gate, a uh, small arch. Uh, maybe not. No. I think I want to... Ah, I see what I want to do. Uh, okay. So what I want to do is put a... Uh, put a gate, which is going to be turned slightly here. Okay. Yeah. Okay, now I'm going to grab a fence... Fence three, 
Okay, fence three. So it's going to come from here to here. Okay. And... Uh, okay. Now, can I get a... Uh, no, no, no. Get the fence back. Can I get a... Ah, nice. Okay. Place is occupied. Okay. Yeah, okay. Like that. So down to there is where it needs to go. So, bring the fence down like this, and over to here. Okay, so it locks there. So up to here, and up to here. Yeah, okay, so that'll be a yard for the... Yeah, okay. That'll be a yard for the graveyard. And then I can put a, a chapel or something down here. Yeah. Okay. Yep. I can get behind that idea. Good. Uh, right. So now we just need a warehouse to empty this guy out. Yeah. Uh, what are we... Well, we're building a granary. Okay. Good. Then we'll be on to houses, right? So I'm just going to up the tempo here. We're into October. I'm going to up the tempo and get uh, get some construction sorted out. Oh, incidentally, I could fire the Thatcher or something like that and get a little bit more going on here. But, you know, if we take a look here, we've got... Yeah, these people are not starving, right? So this is good. We have a messenger from... Uh, Balaclia. Uh, they are offering... What do they buy? They... They're not going to buy any of the stuff that we're selling. Uh, they are selling stuff. They're selling stone. Now, I, I want to buy some iron. Yeah... I'll buy it now, and then I'll have it, right? Yeah, deal. Okay. Uh, right, so I've got a guy here, so it should be able to unload. Yeah. Okay. Now let's, uh, let's let time roll and finish constructing the... Uh, the granary. Uh, once I have the granary, uh, I'll put the cut and then we'll be down to building houses. And that will be a... Uh, that'll be the attract new people situation. Okay, all the resources have arrived. Now it's time for construction. Oh, there's the iron. Right? There we go. We're unloading the iron. Yeah, one guy is enough to do that, so excellent. There's one more wagon full of iron that will be coming. Right? And then... Uh, no. Yeah, there'll be... Yeah, one more. And then... There it is. And... Come on. Where's the guy? There we go. We're unloading. Good. There we go. Uh, so that's iron acquired. So we won't run out of that for a while now. Uh, this is uh, running along nicely. Uh, right.
Okay, that's... Uh... Okay, it's done. Now, uh, we're going to uh, put potatoes. Uh, that's under P. Potatoes. Yeah. Uh, we're going to try storing a thousand of them. And we're going to add uh, also buckwheat. We're going to add a thousand of that there. And we're going to add honey. And we're going to add a thousand of that. And we're going to also allow buying from local producers. Okay. Now, uh, we're going to go in here and we're going to hire the ladies. And we're going to supply with laborers as well. Okay. And we'll hire a worker. Because we'll have to have a worker at least. Right. Uh huh. So now we're up to building houses, and uh, I think that's the important part now. Uh, right is uh, building uh, building houses, uh, which we can do as the snow flies. So uh, this is uh, coming up on the end of uh, 1722, uh, where we have. Uh, a granary which uh, can have stuff in it uh, is the farm empty not yet um, right uh, okay so I think I probably want to do this uh, so that we can uh, get some uh, laborers moving stuff. Uh, we don't need this guy for the moment. Right? So we're going to bring uh, resources up from here. Yeah. Okay. And we have a messenger here. They want charcoal. Let's sell the charcoal. We have 2,000 in the export stock. Let's sell it. Deal. Okay. And that's going to require getting the worker back there. Okay. Well, I'm going to put the cut here. Uh, this is... Uh, yeah, we'll let uh, some uh, stuff actually happen here. Uh, yeah, so we got stuff has arrived in here. Uh, so we've got some honey here. We've got buckwheat. We've got potatoes that are uh, decaying. Uh, but uh, that is fine. Uh, yeah. Anyway. Uh, I'm going to put the cut here. Things are eh, moving along. Uh, so I'll mention on the way out, I do have a Patreon. Uh, if you feel like you want to support the channel for some reason, uh, yeah, the link will be in the description if you're interested. If not, we'll just ignore the link in the description. And I guess uh, all that said, see you back next time.